Hi, Marek Mulaczyk here and welcome to this video in which I'm going to talk about a specific feature in After Effects, keyframe interpolation and using keyframe interpolation with your animations in Adobe After Effects. So without further ado, let's get started. Now in this video, we're going to make this ball move in a straight line because what you have in right now is something like this. I've changed something just so we got exactly the same result right now. And when I stop it and select the layer, you can see the path is like this. That's what you get by default. Because by default, After Effects doesn't move the object in a straight line, not when you have multiple keyframes. But it's actually easy to solve. It's something called a keyframe interpolation. That's what we're going to talk about in this video, keyframe interpolation. And by default, After Effects is using this uh, Bezier interpolation, which means it's giving you curves. But in here, we want straight lines. So what we'll do is, this is all for the position. We're not touching rotation here, okay? On the position property, we need to select all the keyframes to start with. So what we usually do is just going to lasso around all these keyframes here. I'll show you a trick later on. This highlights all the keyframes, so they all get blue. With all keyframes selected, we'll right-click one of them, doesn't matter which one, because they all highlight it anyway. So just right-click one of them and go to keyframe interpolation here. This will give you a dialog box. And by default, the spatial interpolation, that's what we're interested in here, because that's for the shape of the path. That's how it changes across space, spatial. It's Bezier or continuous Bezier. In this case, we want it to be linear. We want it to be straight lines. And I will click OK. And I get perfectly straight lines and the ball will move perfectly along the line. Just like that. So all we did here was highlight all the keyframes, just lasso around all the keyframes, right click one of them, doesn't matter which one, and open keyframe interpolation, and we set this spatial interpolation to linear. Otherwise you get Bezier which gives you curves. And I'll click OK. Now I'll show you why uh, mine was straight to start with. Because you see this uh, setting in your After Effects uh, preferences, we can tell After Effects to make them linear by default and you can always change that later on. So what you can do is you can go to your preferences, which you can find under Edit Menu on Windows and under After Effects Menu on a Mac, and then go to General. And in General Category, there's a tick box here, Default Spatial Interpolation to Linear. And this is not ticked by default. So once you tick it, all your animations will be straight, will be straight lines automatically. That's what I have as a default because most of the time I want them to be straight. And if I want them to be curved, I'll click OK here. At any time, you can highlight all the keyframes, right click one of them again, go to keyframe interpolation and change it to Bezier and click OK and you get what we had before. Let's come to undo. I think the question here is which one are you going to use most, more or most of the time? Linear or Bezier? And that's the one you can set up in your preferences because this will save you a lot of time. So you just choose what you want the default behavior to be here, default spatial interpolation to linear. You decide, you choose what you want to do. This is not ticked by default, but I've got it ticked. And I'm going to click OK. And now we have this beautiful animation for our animated ball. 